Today is April 20th, and April is National Poetry Month. In celebration, the University of Arkansas Press, home of the Miller Williams Poetry Prize, is sponsoring the Poetry Minute here on KUAF. Today, we hear from Leo Mazo reading Chaplinesque by Hart Crane. Chaplinesque. We make our meek adjustments contented with such random consolations as the wind deposits in slithered and too ample pockets. For we can still love the world who find a famished kitten on the step and no recesses for it from the fury of the street or warm, torn elbow coverts. We will sidestep and to the final smirk dally the doom of that inevitable thumb that slowly chafes its puckered index toward us, facing the dull squint with what innocence and what surprise. And yet, these fine collapses are not lies more than the pirouettes of any pliant cane. Our obsequies are, in a way, no enterprise. We can evade you and all else but the heart. What blame to us if the heart live on? The game enforces smirks, but we have seen the moon in lonely alleys make a grail of laughter of an empty ash can, and through all sound of gaiety and quest, have heard a kitten in the wilderness. I didn't skip a beat. This was the first poem I thought of. As an art historian at the U of A, I try to understand different forms of American modernism, and this better than many poems. And I'm thinking of William Carlos Williams, T.S. Eliot, many people better known, in fact, than Hart Crane. This work, more than most, elaborates on modernism's emphasis upon experience and expressions as ends in their own right. Chaplinesque is a poem by Hart Crane. Leo Mazo is an associate professor of American art history at the University of Arkansas and is the author of the book Thomas Hart Benton and the American Sound. Join us each day this month for the latest Poetry Minute sponsored by the U of A Press on KUAF. Look for archived minutes at KUAF.com. Remember to join us for tomorrow's Poetry Minute. Our featured reader will be Ellen Compton.